your secrets if you really look at yourself you will be speechless what happened to being doctors and teachers what happened to being your brother's keeper nowadays kids more worried What's going on guys, Squad Daddy here bringing you a gameplay here on Infection and obviously as you can see by the beginning montage that was the first half of this game and that's how the players in this lobby were deciding to play and uh, that put a little bit of fire in my bones and made me put my backpack on and, and try really really hard. I didn't think we were going to win this game but we did actually win it, spoiler alert. Um, and I was really happy with it. Um, you're going to see me now completely try-harding, absolutely trying my best, and uh, yeah, uh, this is, was one of my better games. And these are the kind of games that I actually do enjoy more than actually getting big kill streaks um, in Call of Duty. I actually like beating uh, players who decide, like, you know when it's the whole team, uh, you know, camping together and you know you got every scenario you got people camping in corners with their brass knuckles trying to unlock it you have the guy with a rocket launcher running around trying to rocket launch then you got about two or three people or maybe even four trying to uh, camp each room and this map in particular as you all know I'm not telling you anything you don't know uh, you know there's two rooms that face each other on this map and this map is notorious from you clear out the campus from one side and then you run to the other side and you clear them out from the other side and it's, you know the cycle just continues so but the main point of this uh, this kind of game showcasing this game is the fact that I didn't have the highest KD in this game but because players were playing like this <laughs> it, it just made me more determined to try to try to play better and you know I really wanted to win this game but whatever man uh, like I said I permanently unlocked this M8A7 look at this guy man look at this guy see you later son you're done <laughs> I permanently unlocked the M8A7 so it was double XP as well um, I think it's double XP all, uh, in fact it is double XP all weekend what am I talking about and uh, I'm I'm basically just using the M8A7 uh, all the time because all the other guns in the game, I'm, I'm, I'm nowhere near unlocking, uh, you know, them to their full potential, to their full unlocking ability. But uh, because this is a new gun, I think I'm just going to be playing with this gun all weekend. And I think this is going to probably be my go-to gun for when times get harder from not playing that well. Um, I used to use, <laughs> oh my god. I used to use the XR2 uh, quite a bit uh, before this, but uh, I started playing off well like I am now with the XR2, uh, you know, like, like I am with this gun here, the M807, uh, you know, with the XR2, but it kind of dropped off and I didn't get, you know, it didn't continue basically. My good run with the XR2 didn't continue. And I picked up the M8A7 off the floor a couple of times, and uh, I know it's a good gun. So uh, I'm really unhappy. Uh, really unhappy. I'm really happy that I've unlocked it permanently now. And I guess I'll just work all weekend to try to try to get this guy unlocked. Uh, I haven't locked. I haven't unlocked any guns to gold, and uh, it's kind of frustrating. In Black Ops 2, I did manage to uh, to get like diamond camo, but I think I will. I, I think I've come to the conclusion that I'll never, ever get dark matter on here, or at least if I do, it'll be as long as it's taken me to try to get to 14th prestige on Black Ops 1. So I'm going into the last 
few little gunfights here. I think I get mugged off right here. Yeah, yeah, there you go. What is it now? Final kill. I'm running around trying to get that final kill, jumping out, desperate to get it. So I actually did want to put this on YouTube because just the way this game made me feel, made me try really hard, um, it just stuck in my memory and you know, if no one watches my videos like they, they're not doing, um, at least I'll remember this game and it'll be on my channel uh, to remember in the future because it really did stick in the mind. But there you go guys, we managed to come out with a victory, managed to beat these pussies uh, back into their little corners and that is it. Hope you guys enjoyed the video, it's been your boy Scrub Daddy and I'm gone.